What's up, I Like Scary? We are back. I hope you guys are having an awesome day because I'm having an awesome day. It feels good to be a horror fan. You guys, we're here to talk about some freaking Halloween ends rumors, and I'm excited. I got these wrong. I actually got <clears throat> uh, a few of you guys sending me this and the freaking DMs, and I had you guys talking about, you know, telling me to cover it. So here we go, you guys. So, man. A page on Instagram named Slasher Fanatic, um, 78. He looks very, you know, trusted and everything, and he's a big Halloween fan. So, and it definitely, you know, I did a little bit more research. It looks definitely legit. So, let's talk about it. So, I've seen this right here from Slasher Fanatic 78. Shout out to you, man. It says concept posters have been removed from the main Halloween ants IMDb page which is like wow you know what's coming next because it's like those are the the um what what's the word it's like those are the get buys we're gonna put this up to get by so we make our own poster on it's cool we're gonna show some you know some fan posters and stuff like that so once they take those down you know what's coming man something's about to be submitted something's about to be up there of their own so that kind of tells us you guys like i told you all though Man, I feel that Halloween ends is approaching approaching very slowly, like promotional stuff and like trailers and, you know, we get the poster. So I feel like it's going to be right, you know, right next to Nope. Jordan Peele's Nope is going to be either in that trailer when we're in that theater watching Jordan Peele's Nope is going to be right before or something to make us, you know, get ready for it. Because, you know, that Universal, um, Jordan Peele's Nope um, by Universal is a very big movie. So, you know, I'm pretty... Shorter thing, like, man, we're going to have a shit ton of people in the theaters. Why not put Mike on the screen to let him know he's coming back? So, we already know, but you know what I mean? So, I definitely think that removing the posters is a big clue that um we got some promotional stuff coming soon from Halloween ends. And I'm so excited. I'm so excited. This is right now. This right here is the movie of the year for me. Uh, you guys should have known that. But um this is movie of the year for me. I think it's going to do so good. Uh, Despite all the rumors we're hearing, all the crazy ass stuff we're hearing, I think it's going to be a good Halloween movie, man. We always do this, you guys. And once the movie gets close and we get the trailer, everybody brain just shifts. And it's like, man, we're ready as Halloween fans. I'm excited. Like I said, you guys, I think it's just going to be a, like a Michael Myers movie, man. <clears throat> you know, with some 78 in there and some explaining, you know. And we're going to get, you're going to get some closure. And David Gordon Green's going to give us a handshake out that damn theater. Um, also, uh, Halloween ends, he's, he also posted Halloween ends marketing coming soon. And the guy from Bloody Disgusting, um, John Squires, uh, he, um, Slash Fanatic had talked to him on Twitter, um, about promotional stuff and everything, and he replied, it's coming very, very soon. Wow. Man, I can just see that just coming up, and I'm going to go crazy because I've been waiting for this. Um, I just can't wait to see it, man. I just can't wait to see the the poster. Uh, that's something I talked about yesterday on um, Scary at Night. By the way, Scary at Night was a seven-hour stream. We covered a lot. One of the best streams that I like Scary History, man. I love, man, I, bro, I loved it. Crazy, but man, it was so wild. Like to think, bro, that when Halloween Kills came out, how I felt when we saw that trailer come. We saw the house burning. You guys remember the feeling? Michael picks up the firefighter. It's like wow bro this shit is really happening so i just can't wait i know as soon as the trailer drops a lot of people are going to just go wow i know i am but i told you guys i will not be surprised i know a lot of people said no they're not, they're not going to do that because they don't do that that's just strictly for CinemaCon. but i feel like that can possibly be the deal man that you know they bring us the CinemaCon trailer and you know gives give us a better one like later in the summer like in august and stuff but i could be wrong maybe it's something they just put together for us but but we talked about it yesterday, you know, on the screen at night about posters and stuff. How do you guys think the posters should look, man? You know, they got, it's like they switched both sides of the face. We had the one with the burn side with the kills, and we had 2018, we had the regular side. So what do you guys think the ending poster should be? I had someone tell me that they want Lori to be on it. And I think that would be cool because it's like if you don't put Lori on a poster, this is our final, you know, hoorah, and, you know, her walk away from the franchise is kind of like, man... But it's also like, you know, we can make a poster for Lori, you know, strictly for Lori. You know, the main poster doesn't have to have Lori on it. But it could, though. It could, though. I definitely see, you know, this is our last one. You might as well throw on a poster. But um, I told him that I think that uh, it's going to be like a front shot of Michael's face. Instead of sides, it's going to be like a front one, like the blood running down his face. 
and it's going to be kind of like in a darkness. Oh, I actually made a concept poster of it, but you know. I think that that's definitely going to be like, you know, the route they take with the poster maybe. I don't see them putting like a Myers house on the front or anything like that. Um, and uh, man, I just, I'm over here thinking about it as I'm talking to you guys. Like just going to see Jordan Peele's Nope and seeing like maybe they play the um, the theme that goes like, dun, 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 dun. like Bro, that would be so crazy. And we see Michael, and you just see like a pan a shot of from his boots to his hand, and he's just walking, and then it's like, oh my, this shit is here. Bro, I might drop a tear, bro, because this I know this is gonna be the final one. Um, some shit is gonna take place in this film, obviously. Um uh, I don't know, man. I just I can't wait to see what they do with the promotional stuff, and because they they're gonna have to promote the fuck out of this movie, you guys. You're gonna have to. Okay, if I had to compare Halloween ends promotion or something, you have to. Cause Scream Five was promoted damn well. I'm not gonna lie, they promoted it damn well, and it kind of. And then when the movie hit the screens, it kind of was like you promoted almost too damn well, cause the film is not adding up to that promotion. So it's like, but they need to promote it almost like you know, um, Scream Five, because it's like wow, bro. This is the end. That's all I keep thinking about. This is the end for us Halloween fans out there. It's, this is the end. We don't know what's going to happen. And I know you guys, we always play with speculation and stuff like that and, you know, theories. But at the end of the day, none of us knows what the fuck is going to happen in this film, to be honest. We don't know. We're just playing around as Halloween fans, which is cool. We're having fun. Because once this is over, it's over. You know, you're never probably going to be able to play with a speculation about seven years plus until Michael comes back. Um, but... Yeah, man, I definitely think that um they need to promote the hell out of this because don't don't show too much in the teaser. That's another thing. But I think they're doing a great job this year at keeping the, the movie close to their chest. Like, no, we can't show you this. We want we wanted to show you this. Like, you know. So I I definitely feel that they're doing a great job. And um man, I know one thing I can I can vouch for with everyone out there that's watching me right now. Um, one thing we want to see the trailer for is that damn mask. We want to see Michael's face. That's what it is. You want to see his mask, you know. That's the number one thing I feel that makes people so anxious. Uh, but it's other reasons, you know, I'm going to touch on right here in a sec. But, you know, the mask. We want to see what did he grow into, you know, what did he change into his mask and what shifted on and stuff like that. So that's another reason why I'm excited. I want to see that look of Myers, man, our final look of him. That's what's so exciting. It gives you, like, like the, the chills. Like, come on, bro, what the fuck? So, you know. Um, I also want to see, you know, Lori on the screen again. See, you know, I, I want to see that. I want to see that cinema con scene when they're battling. I want to see Michael and Lori going at it. And, and, you know, they're saying, like, it's almost like a 78 feel because she's in the closet and she jumps out on him. And Michael has the butcher knife in the freaking, uh, in the kitchen. Like, he's stalking her and looking for her. So, I can't wait to see that. If they can possibly show us that, maybe they won't. But I kind of feel that will be the trailer we get. Like, you know, because I don't know if you guys remember Halloween Kills. They had, like, a, they had a little small trailer. It was when the balloons were colorful and they were on the gates. And they showed, like, no, no, let him burn. Let him burn. And then, like, it shows, I forgot the rest. I want to say, it, uh, it, it's not even that long. It's about 15 seconds. But I think it's going to be exactly like how that trailer was, like, a lot of stuff just flashing, like, and, you know, you see kind of a slow motion thing to close out the trailer. Maybe they're, like, going at each other, and it just pops up, like, dun, 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 dun. like, you know how it goes. You guys as Halloween fans. Uh, so when I say that, bro, I'm like, man, what the fuck? I'm really doing a thing. <laughs> But, you know, I think it's going to be like that. Just a lot of flashes and then a slow pan and shot of something. And then the, the freaking logo pops up. Halloween and it's coming October 14th. Um, but then we're going to get it. Now, that's the trailer that's going to be scary to watch. Because I do want to go in this film. I'm going to watch it for sure because I got to cover for you guys. But, you know... I'm, I'm gonna be scared to see the, the the end trailer that approaches right before the film because that's where they try to get those people in the seats. Which Halloween, David Gordon Green, you guys, Blumhouse, you know that we're going to see this movie. Even if motherfuckers are saying rumors that you know Michael is going to die in the first 20 minutes, we're still willing to go see Michael on that big screen, you know, and see you know what's going on with him and what the hell is the problem and stuff, and just going to see where the story ends and all that jazz. So. You know, you guys, that's all, you know, I wanted to talk to you guys about today. Um, but this is the end of the video, you guys. Comment down below what you guys think about everything we talked about. 
But don't forget to hit me on my social media. I like Scary on Instagram. I like Scary 77 on TikTok. Brandon Allen on Facebook. I like Scary on Twitter. And don't forget you guys become a member of the Patreon to get exclusive content and benefits of the channel. Also, right there where it says subscribe, next to it says join. You could click that and become a, a channel member and get exclusive content such as like private watch parties and bonus content. And don't forget to check out the merch store to get you some I like Scary merch. You guys, watch some horror movies out there. Stay scary. I love you all. I like scary. Peace out.